Hello, my name is Jenny and I am a tester. A tester, what is a tester, you say? Um, so if you're wondering what a tester is, I'm, I'm gonna explain now, so bear with me, please. So, I am a detective. What? I just said I was a tester. I know, I'm also a detective. Why I say I'm a detective? Let me explain. In order to do my job, I have to investigate, put clues together, look for answers, find out if a story I was told is real. For real. You have to ask questions. Or if there's anything hidden that needs to be uncovered, like, you know, all those hidden details that people think that they, just because they have them on their head, you should know about them. Well, you need to ask those questions. So that's why you become a detective. You, as a tester, I'm also a, a storyteller. Um, with every test that I perform, I tell a story, a very detailed story. Other people depend on this. I'm also a truth teller. I bring to light the complexity of a test, even when it appears to be very simple and the change to be very small. It might be a very small change, but will require a lot of testing. What am I trying to say? What does everything I just said say mean? Um, well, I'm always working on challenging intellectual, intellectual exercises. I am an observer. I present back, um, facts based on findings, and that's very important. You always present facts based on findings. So you still don't have a clue as to what is it that I do. Huh. You know what, I'm gonna keep you waiting a little bit longer, and I'm gonna explain um, some of the things that I don't do. So, as a tester, I don't present suppositions or gut feelings, not gut feelings. I don't use phrases like, I think that is the problem. Um, maybe, or I'm not really sure, those are phrases we don't use when you're presenting facts or findings, right? I don't go around pointing fingers, but I do present facts. Um, I don't go around um, to looking on whom to blame for something, but instead I work with teams to find solutions to a problem I discover. Um, for some people, it might sound like um, testers, we only present bad news. But think about it. Is it really bad news that you are presenting? Would you rather not find out about a problem and lose millions or billions of dollars? Have your company closed down? Could happen, right? Something catastrophic happens. Um, or because you didn't find something out because you didn't test, um, we, you could have prevented a certain situation from happening if you just taken the test, um, the time to test. And given the importance it serves, you might have maybe um, prevented a, a failure that. Um, and would have prevented people to die, right? Um, of course not, nobody wants that. So through testing, you provide quality and safety. I still haven't said much, have I? You still don't know what I do. So, but I, at least even though that you might not understand what I do, I do hope that you start understanding the importance of a tester. So another question would be, is there a right or wrong way to test? I don't think so. Each person, um, based on their skill set and experience, will have different ways of testing. I, I can tell you that a tester needs to be creative. It needs to be a creative person. Um, a tester is always developing new skills and acquiring new knowledge to uncover hidden problems and mitigating any potential issues with a product. A tester is always looking for ways to be proactive rather than reactive. That's why you have to think ahead. So a tester is on a mission. Um, the mission of a tester is to help find potential problems and issues that may cause um, 
fatalities or big problems once the product is pushed out to production. That's our mission. Um, is the work of a tester, a tester rewarding? Yes, it is. Testers, um, they get happy when they find a bug. It's like candy to a child. It's like being a superhero when you find a, a, a bug. Um, and why you get happy? Well, if you found something before you went to production, you should be happy. You are helping the organization and employees to better understand where they are at with a project and what issues need to be tackled, right, before it goes out. You are helping the developers improve their product. You might have prevented a disaster from happening. You're adding quality to a chain of previous events and future ones. So I hope this gives you an idea of what a tester is, or what a tester does, and the importance of a tester role, and that you might get motivated to join this profession and enjoy it. Bye-bye.